Hello and everybody. Welcome to another puzzle solving session with me. Today I am going to solve an interesting puzzle for you that's already drawn in this board. Okay. In generally, it looks very clumsy. But if you think the logic quite carefully, you can easily be able to solve this puzzle. Let's directly jump to the logic. I am going to show how to solve this puzzle. Okay. Let's see. The first diagram is denoted as D1, the second one is D2, the top left bottom diagram is denoted as D3 and the final diagram is denoted as D4. Now consider the diagram D1. Here total 5 circles are there. forming a plus sign okay three circles are in horizontal order and three circles are just in vertical order now consider the sides small circles okay how we can achieve the middle number in this diagram one in case of diagram one If we add all the numbers placed in side circles, then what we get? We get 6 plus 8 plus 3 plus 7 equal to 24. And if we divide 24 by total number of side circles. How many total number of side circles uh, are there in each diagram? That is 1, 2, 3, 4. So 24 by 4 equal to 6. That is the middle number of diagram number 1. If we put the similar logic in other 3 diagrams and believe me the whole puzzle is based on this particular logic. In case of diagram number to the same thing we get 5 plus adding 5 plus 8 plus 11 plus 12 by 4 equal to 9 in case of d3 it's simply 8 plus 3 plus 2 plus 7 divided by 4 equal to 5 now consider diagram number 4. So in case of diagram number 4, how you will get the answer which will be replaced in question mark? That is adding all the side numbers 20 plus 21 plus question mark plus 1 and dividing it by total number of side circle that is 4 equal to Let's it is 12 and I have applied this logic in other three diagrams. So 42 plus question mark equal to 12 into 4 is equal to 48. So question mark equal to 48 minus 42 equal to 6. So, if we put 6 in place of question mark, then the overall pattern is completed and we achieve the 12 by applying the same logic. That's the way we have to solve this puzzle. Thanks for having your time.